The Westboro Civics Club's mission is to benefit the town of Westboro and its residents. Our members derive satisfaction through personal participation in fundraising activities and the promotion and development of community services and fellowship. We donate to deserving nonprofit organizations, schools, and our community throughout the year to meet a broad spectrum of needs. While operating the annual tree lot is our primary source of funds and fund, just as important to our members is not that we sell all our trees, but that the money raised is used for the benefit of our community. This short film focuses on just one instance where we believe we have turned the money raised from the sale of trees into a meaningful, sustainable initiative. The community harvest brings benefits to not only the recipients, but also many townsfolk associated with their work. It also gave Civic Club members the chance to become personally involved in helping out a great organization that does good for many, many people. My name is Amy Navin. I'm the Executive Director for Community Harvest Project. Community Harvest Project is located in North Grafton, Massachusetts, but it's a farm that services all of Worcester County. We donate 100% of the produce that we grow to the Worcester County Food Bank for distribution to 178 partner agencies throughout the county, including here in Westboro, Massachusetts. We approached the Westboro Civic Club specifically um, to see if, there, if they could help us um, in advocacy throughout Westboro in response to a need for critical equipment. If we wanted, um, the whole diggers are $180 retail a piece, and I believe that the wholesale cost is somewhere around half of that. So $500 would theoretically buy five whole diggers. One of the wonderful things that came out of that was uh, not only the beginning of a relationship for volunteering, but also a financial donation that we could specifically target um, the need for this equipment. In specific, we were looking for hole diggers. And because of the donation from Westboro Civic Club, we were able to purchase an additional five hole diggers. What was uh, exciting for us was that we were currently working with several um, organizations throughout Worcester, one of whom was the Westboro Public Schools, that all of the fifth graders from the Mill Pond School were going to be coming out to Community Harvest Project. And so that was a real way to get, um, to sort of tie back into what the Civic Club is all about. And specifically, what we're all about is helping neighbors help neighbors. And we have a focus on teaching that to kids. So it just all seemed to work together, that sort of weaving that happens throughout the community. I'm Karen Gowan. I teach social studies at Milton School. And I'm here with three homer classes for my team today. We are planting a variety of vegetables, including carrots and beans. And I'm not sure what else we're planting out there. Uh, the children are very, very actively engaged. Some of them have never done any uh, work of this type before, and they're excited to be a part of this project. Uh, many of us didn't know that the farm actually existed, and that we were doing uh, steps to reduce uh, hunger and need in the Worcester County area. So we're excited to have an opportunity to do this uh, community service project.
like any nuts. The three weeks are sleeping in the bank. Hi, bed Yeah! It's not just about selling trees or even donating the money. It's, it's finding organizations like this that get the community of Westboro involved. It's good to see the, 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 the club members come out here and volunteer. We're working on the farm today and it's getting involved in the Westboro community which brings the club out and the selling the trees is just a means to that end. At any given day, a community harvest project, you will find volunteers doing any variety of work. Our farming season starts in uh, March in the greenhouse and we plant every single plant, we start every single plant from seed in the greenhouse. Um, this is for a couple of reasons. First, because although we're not certified organic, we do use best organic practices. So we have specific seeds that we purchase. Um, the greenhouse is warm and everybody likes to work in the greenhouse. So we start every um, plant from seed and from there it goes out to the greenhouse. From the greenhouse it goes out to the cold frames. From the cold frame it goes out into the ground so we would use volunteers to do everything from digging the holes to planting the plants to covering them up to quality control. Later on in the season um, you will see people weeding. We need to um, again because of the practices that we use the best practices we don't use any herbicides in the field and so the plants need to be hand weeded and um, you would find volunteers doing that. You would find volunteers uh, certainly harvesting, and that goes for beans, carrots, zucchini, summer squash, uh, eggplant, cabbage, any variety of produce that we grow is, um, or all the varieties of produce that we grow are harvested by hand and by volunteers. Um, last year, in 2009, we delivered 48,000 pounds of produce to the Worcester County Food Bank. That was despite the, lo the loss of roughly 20,000 pounds of tomatoes due to disease. This year, to date, we have harvested over 37,000 pounds of produce. That puts us at 70% of what we delivered the entire year last year. So we expect to deliver more than 80,000 pounds of produce this year. In addition, we've had the good fortune of um, being invited to an apple orchard, so we've delivered an additional uh, 2,400 pounds of apples this year to the food bank, which was unexpected. Westboro Civic Club is an entirely nonprofit organization dedicated to the benefit of the town of Westboro and its residents. Your purchase of a Christmas tree from the Civic Club lot helps us to achieve the objective of helping others in and around our town of Westboro. You too can help out, such as Community Harvest. Just contact the folks there at Volunteer Hotline 508 839 7402, extension 1, or by going to their website at www.communityharvest.org. Feel free to mention our name. We would also love to think you may want to get more involved with a club such as ours. If you have any interest in joining the Westboro Civic Club or finding out more about us, you can always contact us via P.O. Box 155 Westboro or go to our website at westborocivicclub.com. Thank you for viewing our story. We hope you enjoyed viewing what we do and we look forward to seeing you at the tree lot next season.